Okay, we're here at Flat Six Labs, uh, demo day, cycle, de cycle one demo day. Uh, please introduce yourself and uh, your company, please. My name is Mohamed Alborno. I'm the CEO of Crowdsway Inc., which is a crowdsourcing platform for film, media, and videos. What we do is we bring two worlds together. We connect clients looking for creative videos and commercials with amazing, talented filmmakers worldwide through our website. How we do this? We do this through two main for-profit sections and one not-for-profit section. The first not-for-profit is the contest, which is a company. The first section on our website is the contest section. Let's say that Wanda wants to create a video. They will come to our website, say we will give 10,000 Egyptian pounds a prize for the best video that represents Wanda. Of course, using those guidelines and our logo and all of the guidelines that they want. People start submitting the final video or commercial and Wanda either chooses the winner or lets the crowd decide the winner. And this way they hit two birds with one stone, they make a good commercial and at the same time they make people watch it as well. Okay. Isn't this for the content creator? Um, a bit risky because you're spending all this time making final content that might not be used ever? That's a really good question because I personally, I hate contests. You know, one person gets to win, others, they just don't win. We created the model so that we can also reward non-winners uh, by different rewards. There are some monetary rewards and also there are some uh, rewards like the best, uh, best, the most contributor award, the most creative award, the awards that we see uh, deserves winning. Either cash prizes or trainings related to filmmaking that might improve him and make him make his uh, submission next time a better place. So uh, this is how we, we, uh, we make it is that everyone is a winner if you did a submission and it was accepted, then you get some points. Those points are transferred later on to rewards financially and also non-financial. We give them also access to our facilities so that they can maybe use our editing stations. Uh, this is not uh, open for everyone at the moment. This is our vision so that we have our, also our own core facility whereby people can uh, can use our you know editing station tools, cameras, uh, things of that sort. And this way we're, we're having a, a community of filmmakers around us that not just think of us as a, you know, a quick way to make just a few bucks and that's it. No, it's a long-term relationship. We help them make steady income out of the things that they love doing and at the same time um, they they also help clients find good amazing videos for uh, or create good amazing videos for their uh, products and services. Okay, so what's your initial target market? Uh, we're initially targeting Egypt, but we're a global, uh, we're a global product. We're currently discussing with the Canadian, uh, Canadian seed investment company the possibility of being incubated at their facility, and uh, we also have external investor from Startup Labs, which is one of the mo the first investments in the region from Startup Labs in a company or a team. So we're 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 starting with Egypt with a few trials, but we're targeting the whole the whole world. Okay, so how are you going to reach your market? First, we'll start with uh, with the networks that we built from our real lives. So I have a network of filmmakers in Manchester, UK, and in the UK. Uh, the community director have a network in Egypt and Qatar and other places. So we use those networks and we'll start appointing ambassadors for every region. Those ambassadors will be the local point of contact with filmmakers in this in the local community. So they will create also filmmaking workshops sponsored by us uh, that will also enable those filmmakers to work on real projects and real assignments, either for, for profit or not, not for profit. And um, uh, so this is the way, of course, we'll have, we have extent, we'll use social media extensively. We have over 100,000 Facebook fans on our page, Crowsway Egypt. And we, are, uh, we have another page that has 3,500 filmmakers that we're in, uh, that we got the, the owner of this page to become our community director so that we can also reach to all of the filmmakers worldwide. Wow. Um, how are you going to make money? We make money by taking commissions on the tra transactions that's done on our website from the first and second section. I only told you about the first section, which is the contest. The second section is talents for hire. 
So the quick answer to your question, we make money from commissions on the paid assignments. Uh, our second section is the talents for hire. The talents for hire, anyone with a specific talent or anything that they can do in life, they can post it on our website and they can say how much money they are willing to charge for people. For example, someone will jump off an airplane saying, I love Wamda.com for $500. Someone will run a marathon wearing a t-shirt written on it, the your company's name uh, for for a hundred dollars. I mean, I ran a marathon, 42 kilometers, without being being paid a single Egyptian pound. I would, for 10 Egyptian pounds extra or whatever, I would put your company's name on my T-shirt. Imagine how much money I would be willing. I would run for free. You know, I would. I mean, I, I wouldn't pay for this. So you're selling um, personal advertising space. Personal advertising space, exactly. Someone will, might uh, find write a song about your company or product or service and sing it. We have. We do have an actual rap artist that was uh, we met in Cairo that can improvise any a song about anything and sing it on a beatbox, just like this. So this this guy can charge you fifty dollars to create something. We have different types of talents. Someone also might say, I will record a video testimonial dressed in a suit and saying, oh, I used your, your product and uh, the product was really good. What you liked about it is that blah, 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 blah. And this way you can put quality material on your website showing that, okay, you participated in a whatever you know conference that no one no one will know about, but you got those people talking about you. So you, you must be legitimate. So we have loads of, the interesting thing is about the diversity of ideas that you can find. You can find amazing people doing amazing different things. Everyone doing it different someone will say I will get 10 people to say one sentence like each person will say one part of the sentence and we'll get the, those people to say it uh, sequentially like, like it says I love crowdsway.com for example and he, he will get 10 people to do this for example for $20 things of that sort so this is we take transactions also on this and we aim here that and I honestly tell you this to bring the talents in everyone and enable loads of people who you know sit all sitting all day on the internet find a way to make money out of this and of course in the middle we find discover amazing talents like this rap artist is now wanting us to produce him a music video for his his, his first music video for his song so that's the, the second section the third section on our website is community projects and here not for profits and independent filmmakers can collaborate and find volunteers who are willing to work with them on their projects uh, for example, I'm a filmmaker myself, and I have a filmmaking film that I want to produce, uh, a feature film, a long film, and I will bring it to this section and tell people, okay guys, whoever wants to make this film happen, it's not about the money, people that want to, to make this film happen, join me. And I got 280 people to join this project, between directors and filmmakers, like uh, cameramen, writers, researchers, different marketing people uh, that can make this huge project happen and also not for profits can do the same thing <laughs> so stuff like that there's already um, direct competition in western countries i mean i've seen collaborative so especially for media where people come together as a project um, is there any direct competition in the region here for, for stuff like this well there are some potential i can't say they are direct competitive but they might evolve to become something competing with us like uh, Kabila and we might find a way to work together but uh, I'm saying they, they might you know compete but at the end of the day there's no real uh, loser here because we're doing good things so uh, I, I don't think there's a real loser our slogan we are the 99% of filmmakers if we make filmmakers if we become bigger we should make filmmakers as well become big as well not just by giving them instant rewards on the things that they do and collaborate on our website. No, I'm talking about more than this. Our vision is to be able to give part of our profits to the most contributors in our website. And I know lots of financial people would disagree with me on this, but because I'm a filmmaker, I've seen people who eat expired products because they cannot afford to buy them. I know how uh, I, I feel, and I know how filmmakers feel, and I feel really um, that you know people should get rewarded 
if, if, if a company or even a not-for-profit becomes bigger, the people who made it bigger, the crowd themselves should also become bigger as well. And this is what we do. This was different than any, anyone in the world and I hope we'll be the first to implement this and you find other companies saying we'll do the same thing because of us.